is up YouTube? Ryan here from the Reptile Guys and today I bring to you Madagascar Giant Day Gecko Breeding Part 1. I have a lot to talk about and I'm going to get right into it. So first of all, if you guys have seen the Reptile Expo uh, video we just did, uh, I did say at the very end of that that the geckos had already bred after placing them, uh, the first day after placing them into this new uh, uh, 18 by 18 by 24 vivarium I bought for them. And uh, I uh, also would like to say I got a picture of that, which I'll show you again. I did show in that video, but I'll show it right now. Uh, as well, I would like to uh, say I did not uh, get a recording of a uh, like a film of them making vocalizations as they were uh, in the pairing cycle, but I did get a recording of it, uh, a sound recording, and I'll show that to you guys right now too. And uh, did if you guys heard that um, uh, that kind of sound, that was Gizmo, um, the male making that noise, and then a lot of the purring was uh, Lily, um, in that uh, clip, as well. Um, I just like to say that when they do, uh, or when sorry, when Lily does lay her eggs, which will be in about two week, two to three weeks from now, uh, she will lay two eggs. Um, more than likely, she'll lay them somewhere here in the substrate, and I'll have to find them. Uh, they will be uh, smaller than marbles, but oval shaped, and uh, then I will definitely make a video on that, keep you guys updated, uh, throughout the incubation process and then the hatching. Now, what I'm expecting of the babies from the two is, um, so Gizmo, uh, he is what is known as a low-end blue blood. Uh, so the low-end is... You see the red spotting on his back? So if that red spotting were to go up to the middle of his back, that'd be called a mid-end. And if it were to go all the way almost to his neck, he'd be called a high-end. And that's just referring to the red. And then uh, the blue blood is his blue tail right there. That's uh, where that comes in, which makes him actually really valuable. And then Lily, on the other hand, uh, she's starting to hide a little bit. Um, she is a high-end, or mid to high-end. I'd call her high-end, though. Which you can see her red patterning goes almost to her neck right there, uh, which makes her high end. And as well, she has a lot of patterning of red on her head, aside from the two um, nostril stripes, which are always present in the geckos. But you can see how uh, Gizmo has no red spotting on his head. Um, Lily actually does have spotting on her head. You can kind of see it right there, uh, which makes her a high end. And then, uh, so what I'm expecting of the babies is... Uh, the cross between high end and low end would be mid end and then uh, blue blood. So mid end blue blood uh, geckos is what I'm expecting, which will actually make them quite more valuable than just your generic uh, Madagascar giant day gecko hatchling, which uh, I will definitely let you guys know what I'll be doing with them. For now, all I know is I will be housing them in this 10 gallon. It's kind of dark right here. Here, I can turn the flash. This 10 gallon right here. Uh, temporarily um, and then I don't know if I'm gonna raise them up myself or uh, I I, uh, I believe Corey might be taking one of them uh, and uh, I'll just have to see but I'll definitely get you guys uh, an update of that when we get there but um, Gizmo did breed with her um, Lily is actually beginning to hide right now which is kind of lame uh, sorry about that guys she's uh 
somewhere uh, right in here. But um, she actually is uh, gravid, so I did give her calcium supplements uh, by her food, which she has been licking, so she can form the eggs properly. And uh, then he did fertilize them, so I'm expecting eggs in two to three weeks, and I will keep you guys updated. Uh, like I said, this will be a series because it will take time before, you know, everything is all said and done. But definitely exciting and definitely get your hopes up, guys, because uh, I'm really excited. So, thank you guys for watching. Uh, make sure to like, sub, and share. And I will see you guys in the next video. Peace out.